Hi you guys, Lookfuck here and welcome back to another FIFA 17 player review. Today we're going to be reviewing the 64 rated English Team of the Season striker, John Akinde. Uh, he cost me 12,000 coins in the 5 games that I played with him. He scored me 2 goals and got me 2 assists. He has a uh, medium medium work rate along with a 2 star weak foot and 2 star skill moves. So let's now get into his in-game stats and highlights. Okay guys, so getting into John Akinde's in-game stats. The 4 main stats on his cover to now to me are his 96 strength, his 84 stamina, his 87 penalties and his his 86 acceleration. He has the specialist of strength along with the two traits of backs into player and target forward. And getting in towards the highlights that I got with John Akinde, um, he wasn't that bad actually. I mean, he certainly wasn't that good, but for a bronze card, you know, there's definitely been worse than I've used. We're going to get straight off into his first pro and only pro, that being his strength. Uh, he genuinely is one of the strongest players I think I have ever used. I'm not even joking. I mean, uh, certainly in a striker position as well. I mean, there were so many times where he was coming up against, you know, centre-backs like uh, Smalling. I'm not even joking, Smalling or, or other gold centre-backs. And he was able, not all the time, but on quite a few occasions, he was actually able to kind of shrug them off the ball, which was very good. I mean, he is six foot two. He does have the 88 physical along with the 96 strength. I was very, very surprised because even though his stats say that they're good on the bronze team of the season, card, it doesn't mean, like, a lot of the time it doesn't actually reflect in game. But his strength actually did reflect in game for me on this bronze team of the season card. And he was actually very strong in game, which was obviously very nice to see and that's kind of where the, the the pros end for this card it's a little bit downhill from here uh, his first one is his skills and weak foot. He does have two star skills and two star weak foot. I mean, for I mean, for like a bronze card, you're never really going to get someone who's got good skill moves. So two star skill moves, I suppose, isn't bad in that case. However, two star weak foot is not very good at all, and that's definitely noticeable. His preferred foot is the right foot, so pretty much his left foot is is like completely useless. Um, so obviously that isn't really that you know, good to have, I suppose, um, and that is definitely something to to consider. And then the next one is that he's just a little bit sluggish when using him, you know, he does have 65 dribbling. I did put on the sniper, which I do believe actually does increase his dribbling, yet he still had like 65 agility on his in-game stats uh, when I checked on footpin. So uh, that was definitely not good. I mean, he just couldn't. He felt like he was stuck in mud a lot of the time. A lot of people will know what I mean by that. Uh, he just wasn't very good in that kind of area. And also in general, he was... I mean, this might be a bit of a harsh one to give him. I felt him to be inconsistent. Having said that, he did contribute four times in um, in five games. Uh, and, like, also in one game, he got two assists and one goal. So, I mean, overall, he's definitely not the worst player I've used. I mean, he did, uh, you know, contribute four times in five games. I'd say of the bronze team in the season cards, he probably is the best one. I mean, this will be the only bronze team in the season card that I'll probably review. I'm not going to start reviewing a bunch of bronze team in the seasons. Nothing like that. Um, I just thought this card looked really good and I wanted to review it. He didn't turn out to be amazing but then again I wasn't expecting him to be uh, I'm surprised he actually got four contributions in in five games but overall I'm going to give him a five out of ten rating I'm going to give him that at, like that high despite the many cons he's got because you know he was a bronze card and I wasn't expecting him to be to be that good you know for 12,000 coins um you know, you may as well, you may as well try him out, you know, you may as well just see if you guys like him, I mean, 86 pace and 88 physical and 70 shooting on a bronze striker is great stats, so maybe he might be worth trying out just for a few games to see if you like him, if you don't, you're only going to lose a few thousand coins in him, but anyway guys, that is going to conclude this uh, bronze team of the season review on John Akinde, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys later.